team and welcome to another episode of Gameplay. I have been discussing doing Twitch for a while but I thought I would do some YouTube like playthroughs before I get into that and work on my technique and my setup because at the moment my camera is balancing on top of two pops and yeah. Anyway. Let's do this again. I had a real great time playing Anthem for you guys the other day and thought I would move on to something a bit different that I don't think anyone has ever done. We are going to replay my first ever video game which is called Claw and it was for Windows 95. So I got it in 1998 when I was three years old. My dad bought it from Dick Smith when Dick Smith was around in Australia and it was my first ever video game and I played it with my dad in our office for a while and it's always been one of my favorite games. So today we are going to be playing Claw. I downloaded a special software that kind of allows me to play it on my Mac at the moment. It's called Wineskin and I'm going to record using QuickTime. So fingers crossed this works out as planned. And without further ado, we're going to com- Okay, so I've just had the world's most like frustrating problem. I've just been sitting here trying to fiddle with the audio and get everything working, but obviously I am inexperienced. I have a Yeti blue microphone and apparently a lot of people actually have problems in terms of static. So it's just going to take me too long to fix it because I need to go out to a concert tonight. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to record using my Rode microphone on my camera. If you guys have any links to some really good setup tutorials tutorials or like any advice that you use for your streaming setups can you please let me know because I want to learn and I need a lot of help and here we go so this was also like the cover work for claw and that's the map that is I don't know, I don't want to like say anything to spoil it because I want you guys to really enjoy this as much as I do. I love those 90s computer graphics, which at the time were like, amazing. versus dogs <laughs> and I've always been a dog person so it was like such a moral dilemma for me to realize that the cats in this are actually like cool so I'm like cats now I'm an animal person but anyway you get get the idea <gasps> it's cool clear the debris Reload cannons and give them another run from our broad side! Nearly all the cannons were destroyed after that last attack, sir. There won't be enough to do any damage. <laughs> Not too impressed. This guy always scared me. For some She's reason, just that one sir. character, because I've watched the cutscene so many times. Sir? Ready the small arms to prepare for attack! He's such a badass. They'll never take us alive! Attack! I'm having so much nostalgia, guys. This is unreal. Oh. Sir, we have captured Captain Clark. This guy's accent just annoyed me all the time. Well, well, this is indeed a rare treat. Captain Nathaniel J. Claw. I hate this guy. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I must inform you that your ship is lost and your crew was left at their mark. Uh, how I should say this? Indisposed? Indisposed. You can't hold me up our own. Uh, my, my vengeance! vengeance. <laughs> oh, I doubt that. You see, you are a gift for the king. 
and will be publicly executed upon our return. Pat, that takes the term cat calling to a new level. Get it? Or was that not funny? Probably Bringing not funny. scoundrels like yourself to justice makes the people feel safer and enforces the might of That's the Spanish Armada and the will of the king. We'll see. They should revoice this character and make it Antonio Banderas, and then oh, I'd be very happy. This is a very happy day for me, Claw. <laughs> I'm sure you will find your quarters at the prison most uncomfortable, and the guards especially hostile. Oh, after all, we can't be too careful with our prize trophy now, can we? Take him away. I love what Claw wears would be a really cool cosplay. It was kind of like a bit of inspo for me with Pirate Catwoman, but I never got around to getting the cloak. Cloak? Coat. Coat. That nose. Is this what like streamers do? Is this boring or are you guys? I hope you're chill. Checking in on you. Keep it down. Hope you're having a lovely day. Last night among the living, even more uncomfortable. This is the coolest thing. The. There's got to be a diagonally. <laughs> What's this? I wonder how long this has been here. When this was on, um, I am writing oh, this with a can't really talk right now. And a piece of torn paper for my confessions for my Spanish captors, and will then hide it in the wall. Beautiful handwriting I for someone executed in the morning in a prison cell for crimes against the king. The exact details as to why are not important. What is important is. That whomever is reading this letter knows that the legendary Nine Lives amulet really exists. Yay. In a town on the other side of the nearby forest, I lost one of the gems for the amulet in a game in one of the taverns. It seems hopeless for me now, but if you, whoever you turn out to be, have more luck than I did and can get out of this godforsaken place, and are seeking the adventure of a lifetime, I encourage you to take the piece of the map that you should find with this letter and go and retrieve the first of the nine powerful gems of the Amulet of Nine Lives. It is an incomplete map, so you will need to find the rest of the pieces, and with that, the location of the rest of the gems. Good luck, and beware. Others now know of the amulet too. Edward to Ben. The Nine Lives amulet? I can't believe it. Could it be true? Hmm. Probably not, but just in case. This is the most badass thing that ever happened. That's it. I want you. Now I'm quite down myself. Huh? <laughs> I love how he's like a house cat, but roars like a lion. So here is the load screen, which is really cool. I am wearing my amulet of nine lives, which actually doesn't have nine gems, but it's what my dad got me when I was younger. So when we played together, it was like the thing we would wear to like play the game. Um, and it's the only thing I saved from my pirate Catwoman cosplay that I sold. So we're gonna select new game. I have already played through like heaps of levels a few years ago. So by selecting new game, it's going to completely reset my stats. And here we go. Level one. So it's a level game. And this is us. I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty fantastic. So it's not gonna be like, you're gonna see me I'm just going to be amazing from the beginning. Um, so obviously you want to collect the treasure. Um, it's really hard to... Yeah, they make funny noises. But um, 
where this level, as you can tell by the cutscene, is like us trying to get out of the prison and we're gonna kill all the dog guards from the Spanish fleet. They're so annoying. Hey, and then you can pick them up and then they start to like freak out, which is... Now I'm just mucking around, but I want to show you all the things. If I throw them... Hee hee hee, dead. Uh, these are, if you die, they're like checkpoints. Okay, so the mouse is like catnip and it makes you jump really, really high. Um, but I'm fairly certain there's something down here and I want to get all the jewels. Yeah, this guy. Oh, that's not helpful. It's so annoying if you just like touch one, they're like, not like dogs are poisonous, but you touch an enemy and you get hurt. Stupid. Anywho, okay, so I'm fairly certain there's like a method for this. I like to always like go ahead as far as I can go so that I can see what I need to do with the catnip, otherwise I get the catnip and I freak out and I run around and I don't use it effectively, so. Oh, this is cool too. Um, what's the game plan? Uh, I don't know, we're gonna find out together, but you'll see what it does. It's like super jump. So now we can jump really high. And the timer, it gives me anxiety actually, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, this is what we need to do. <gasps> no! I'm fairly certain there was something else, but you know what? Whatever. Oh, oh, oh. I don't know why I did that. But there's nothing down here. I love these random bricks that defy physics. So clever. Ooh. Let's just go down here. Hey! I still haven't um, showed you guys like what kind of... Okay, so I've got a gun, which is cool. Um, then I have something called Magic Claw, which I'm gonna save. Wow, how rude. Um, Magic Claw is like... He's got some superpowers, it's really weird, and I'll show you later, but we've only got five of them. And then we've got three sticks of dynamite, so I'm gonna stick to the gun right now because that's like the most ammo I have. Um, the gun bullets are very common to come across, but the cat, like the magic claw is very rare. Like, that's, that's a rare um, ammo to come across. The stupid mouse. Who wears bandanas like that? That's why you're dead. Oh, I love how I just hit him in the head and he's like, hm, just doing my normal Sunday. Sunday? What day is it today? Saturday here. <gasps> okay, I'm gonna get that. Or do I wanna go up here? What's more important? <gasps> oh, I missed it already. That was stressful. Do I go this way? Oh, heck. Oh, no. Get out of my way, get out of my way. Oh, no, 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 no. <gasps> if you fall into that stuff, you die. So, we don't want that. There's something else that I've got to do. Oh my gosh, no, no, no. Basically, there's a lot of stuff up there that I just missed out on, so jokes on me. Sorry guys, you're not gonna see it unless you do it yourself. I hate these guys. They're so not oh, 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 oh. Catnip. I think I know what's going on. Oh, it stops. Ah, stressful experience 101. So far so good. Oh, checkpoint. No! It was for this and it's gone. Oh well, okay. As you can tell, I've played this like 50 million times. I hate it. Screw you. Leave me alone! Leave me alone! I killed two of them. Ah, oh, why so annoying? 
Oops. Oops. I, I forgot what button it was. <laughs> My gun was. Okay, I'm gonna use this for something. Oh my gosh. No. Everything is calm, fine, dandy. Ooh, is that gold I smell? Oh, yay. Okay, we really want to get into that wormhole. I'll show you why. So I'm assuming we need the mouse for that. I'm really upset. I'm really sad. I'm just giving up. Actually, do you know what we're gonna do? End game. And we are going to load it from save point one so we can actually go into the wormhole. I promised you the wormhole and that's what we're gonna do. Let's get to the wormhole. Okay. More rocks to find physics. Screw you. Okay, I'm gonna grab that. I should have timed this. I didn't time it. Uh, if we're gonna do this again, I'm gonna be very upset. I don't care, I missed everything, but we got there with one second. Yes. Okay, this is why. Now, I'm gonna kill him. Can I get up there? No, that's just stupid. Oh, there's another one. Haha, -ha. so that's, when you go into a wormhole, there's another wormhole and you don't want to go into another wormhole unless you've done all the things in the first wormhole. Just like normal wormholes. Never been to a no normal wormhole. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, let's go. Stressful, stressful, stressful. Don't shoot me. Why do I need this? Oh, great. Okay, I'm fairly certain it's for... Obviously, I'm not as good as I've very clearly made myself out to... That's just the look of defeat. Oh, oh, yay! Now, how do I? Oh, I'll just kill you for now. Oh. Okay. That was overly dramatic. I didn't need to be. Alright. There's something here that I remember that I've stumbled across. But as you can see, we found something else. Let me show you. Cause I did this by accident before. See, look, another wormhole that I should have not died into. Okay, this is- What a death trap. We just can't lose two lives, guys. I know that seems like unreasonable of me, but I'm not having it. I'm not having it. They are rare. It's not like you can just like get XP and like get new lives. They, you stumble across them. With that being said, we're just gonna keep going. We're gonna go, we're, we've done this 50 times. There's no actual like benefit to getting all the jewels apart from like satisfaction you can finish the game um, and not get all the money it's pretty impossible actually but I will want to try that one again let's do that avoided the the popsicles of death what are they even just like icicles or like they're like guys we need to fill these gaps with um preferably pointy things that's what she said okay here we go what a death trap what do you mean? What's happening? Should I go to the other side? <gasps> no. No, 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 no. Yeah, that's not happening. Not today, Satan. Let's just keep going and pretend we never saw that. Why were there all those? No. Okay. Oh, this is pretty cool. It's kind of like a waste of time, but still fun. Oh, it's like when you, it's the 
lift. You gotta wait for it all, all the way back down. Ooh. Obviously we don't need to go this way. Screw you. Okay. Free money. I look. Imagine this in real life. It's a prison and they've just got cardboard, well not cardboard, wooden boxes filled with coins. Oh, what's this? Get out of my way. Okay, where does this go? Am I gonna get killed again? Because I really don't want that. Have I gone the wrong way? I've gone the wrong way. Hold on. What a... I'm assuming I come around in a circle? Oh. I want it. Oh, wait, what? I hate these mice. I'm so stressed. Get out of my way. I feel like this game's really teaching me a lesson and that's not to stress, which is virtually impossible because I'm a stress head, as you can tell. Something like happens, I just like, get overwhelmed. But let's not do that again. I'm gonna practice being calm and you know, all that jazz. Oh, is this why, what it was for? Oh. I did one successful. I think my heart just skipped a beat. Like imagine if that happened, not today. <laughs> No reason, just dynamite. And the mouse was for the wormhole that I wanted, but I didn't do it. I remember, um, there's a skull. I'm never gonna catch it, but I do remember this. Something cool that, um, I remember watching gameplay of Claw on YouTube years ago and going, I could do this so much better than how they played it. Absolutely not. <laughs> yes! Okay. So, I don't know where this leads. <gasps> that was close. That was stressfully close. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I, I don't think I've, have I been here before? <gasps> oh no, oh no, oh no. Hyper stressed, hyper stressed. I want those bullets, I want those bullets, I want those bullets, I want those bullets. I just wanted the bullets. Surely there was another purpose for that mouse. Maybe you were meant to like do all the crumbly rocks and then get the mouse last and then there was something here. It was the skull. Anywho, it's done. Can't do it again. Game has been saved. And there was something there as well. Oh well. Oh, cool. Thanks. Um, let's go up. Stupid. I hate you. Get out of my life. What is down here? Oh. Ooh. <laughs> Wasted on a cross. Oh, bad thing is if treasure like gets into the spikes or whatever thing is there to kill you, it dissolves. Literally, like a gold goblet will dissolve from the spikes. Logic! So much logic in this game, but I'm not asking any more questions. <gasps> Go away. Now, there's surely a purpose for this. So, in hindsight, you could probably like fly through this game pretty quick, but then there's just the satisfaction of doing these little kind of side quests. I wouldn't say side quests, but... Oh, is that what it's for? 
in MOA. Surely there was something else. Oh well. I can't be bothered. Yay. It's telling me to go up, but part of me wants to go down. Don't die again. I don't have time for this. We're just gonna keep going. I'm gonna break this up in levels one. <gasps> Maybe we should. Live a little, Laura, come on. I mean, live a little and try not to die. I don't think I've ever been this existential. Is that the right word to use? <sighs> Sorry, my alarm went off. That's telling me that it's time to wrap it up, which is probably a good thing because we have just finished very, no, 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 no. I believe, I believe in something called conservation and we can't lose two lives for me just being an idiot. That's not happening. Ooh. So we're just gonna power through. Let's see how fast I can do it without doing side quests. Get out of my way. Get out of my way, I don't have time. Do I have time? Yes, I always have time. No, that was just silly. Maybe I should get the crown. Oh, it's too late. Don't matter. I'm gonna lose the plot. Alright, should I? So close to swearing. And with that, we're just gonna finish the game. I'm, I'm not doing that again. I don't know. I just don't have the time right now. But. <coughs> get out of my way. Now. This is the exciting. Ow. Just whack my elbow on the wall. This is the exciting part. We got a piece of the map. So, I feel like this has just been a very tutorial-y video of me just sharing all these things about the game, but every second, look, he gets Hello. impatient. At least bring me something back from the kitchen, is what he says sometimes. Anyway, so one level will have a map, then the second level will have a boss, map, boss, map, boss. So we're going to do like one level at a time because I really want to play this whole thing through, but boom. I've got this song on my iPod. Weird thing to have on your iPod, but. Hmm. A drawing of the amulet. Now to finally escape from this prison and collect all of the nine gems. That's just showing me how poorly I did, which is nice. Um, yeah. So, yeah, as I said, it's just like personal gratification. You don't need to collect everything, but it just shows me how bad I did. Guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed this gameplay and I will be posting maybe level two next week. We'll try and do one a week. But yes, if you have any suggestions on setup and things like that, I really wanna do more of these videos with you guys and different games as well. And like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe if you haven't subscribed and all that stuff and love you so much. Okay, goodbye.